few cards I want to play out. Okay, so you've got the Knight of Cups here, you've got the Four of uh, sorry, the Three of Swords, and the Lovers card, as well as the Page of Swords. Okay, so strong air energy, a Gemini, a Libra, or Aquarius here. Pisces, um, also water energy here. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. So this person's energy, they're definitely thinking about you, okay? In fact, they probably haven't stopped thinking about you. And just because this person may not necessarily be, um, they may not be communicating with you does not indicate that you're not on their mind. Uh, you're definitely dominating uh, their mind space here. Now, with regards to this person with the Knight of Cups, this is someone who had a very strong romantic uh, romantic attraction. Okay, This is someone who did have a very strong romantic interest in you, Pisces. It was a slow-moving energy, so maybe this person was really slow to make a move. Or perhaps this person never really made a move purely because of the Three of Swords here. There was some sort of blockage here, something here that prevented them from making the move. Um, However, I do feel like the situation here with the Three of Swords has resulted in heartbreak for you, Pisces. So perhaps this, there was a third party situation. Maybe the reason why this person never made a move is because they were in a relationship or they were in a connection with someone else. Um, or maybe they were aware that you were in a relationship or you were a connection. You were in a connection with someone else. Hence, why they've never really made the move. Something about feels as though something about this feels as though this person feels like they've missed out. They've missed out on the opportunity to get to know you a little bit better. They've missed out on the opportunity to explore this connection. It's like they had, there was a very strong romantic energy here as indicated by the Knight of Cups and the Knight, uh, the, Knight the Lover's Card and the Knight of Cups. And um, they had every, I feel like they had really good intentions here and they had every intention of making a move. Or they had very uh, they had every intention of escalating things to the next level it just seems though something he didn't go according to plan something he it feels like something he didn't unfold here as they um, had hoped there was some sort of there was pain here so were they the ones who have caused you this pain here Pisces or or was this person on the receiving end of it? Because the Three of Swords, this is pain, this is heartbreak, this is rejection, this is loss. It is a heavy energy. It's a lot of uh, tears shed here. So, I feel like there was something here. There was either a blockage here when it comes to your romantic energy here. There was something here, and I do get for a lot of you here, I do get a sense of a third party situation. Um, maybe this person did have a romantic interest in you, Pisces, but because they were in a relationship with someone else, they never really acted on their feelings for you here. They still think about you though. They still think about you. They even think from time to time about possibly reaching out here. They think about the opportunities they could have had with you here Pisces they think about what could have um, happened between the two of you had the two of you explore this connection further here a very strong infatuation here a very strong infatuation but either something here has resulted in heartbreak for the both of you either due to the fact that this person might have rejected you um, might have rejected you here um, you might have felt a sense of pain rejection um, some sort of emotional, heavy emotional disappointment, a very heavy emotional disappointment here, Pisces. So you might, you, you may feel as though this is someone who has wronged you, or you feel as though you've had a very strong romantic interest in this person, but because something here maybe prevented this person from acting, and it could be due to a third party situation, it could be due to outside influences um, or factors here. And maybe that, that's why, you know, that's why I'm seeing the heartbreak is because something here didn't go quite the way you had um, anticipated. This person does think about you, though. They think about you. They think about the, uh, the connection you shared, the memories you formed here, the attraction that they felt towards you, the way that you would look at them here. They think about 
And they still think about you, he Pisces. I feel like, to me, I get a sense why this person... I feel like why this person feels hurt or why you potentially might feel hurt by this connection is because you knew that you shared something really special with them. You knew that you had something, you had an incredible, you know, you were incredibly attracted to them. You you had a very strong romantic, um, you had very strong romantic interests or there was a very strong romantic energy that existed between the two of you. But it's almost like they were holding back. They were allowing, you know, something here to come in the way. Or they were allowing maybe outside influences here, factors to, you know, to prevent this connection from going any, um, from being explored any further and any deeper here. Because I feel like they were holding back. They wanted, with the Knight of Cups here, okay, they wanted Pisces. They had a very strong romantic interest in you here. They, they could have even potentially have fallen in love with you. This is someone who has obviously caught, um, you know, feelings here. He's definitely caught, you know, some feels for you here. But it feels like they were very slow to act on it. Or there were things that have prevented them from acting on it. And this is why they keep thinking about it. Because it's that sense of regret. Regret is very strong here. It's that sense of what could have been. Okay, what could have been. And they often think that maybe what could have been should have been. They're confused. They're not sure that they've made the right decision. They're not sure that... They, they, there's a lot that this person wants to say to you here, Pisces. There's a lot that this person wants to say to you. But they're not reaching out to you. Because they're not sure. They're not sure how you would respond. They want, they're not sure if... If this is someone who has hurt you, whether they've ghosted you or whether they've, you know, um, have, have caused you some emotional disappointment, this person isn't sure whether you've healed from it. So them reaching out to you might be a little bit awkward, might be a little bit uncomfortable. So I feel like there's something key that's holding them back. They're thinking about you a lot here, Pisces. They are. You're very much on their mind here. But there's something here that's um, causing them to hold back here. And I feel like it's a lack of clarity. It's a lack of certainty here. All right, Pisces. Um, thank you again for uh, listening and uh, watching the tarot spread here. Thank you for your support. Um, Please feel free to leave behind a like, a share, or um, subscribe to the channel. Um, otherwise, guys, I'm, I will be catching up with you all later in the week. Bye for now.